When I delivered it to the label, I, I didn't give them individual songs. I gave them a one long stream of 42 minutes and you have to listen to it from beginning to end because mm. it's an experience that you have to jump into the whole thing, I think, you know, whether you're into it or not. Some of these songs came out as complete yeah. entities, you yeah. know, not, not as kind of fractured little projects. Yeah. You know, John Cleese said of Peter Cook, that um, he was the only comedian he knew that could write a three-minute sketch in three minutes. Yeah. So it seems to me that you've arrived at a similar place, you know, with this yeah. album, you know, with other songs in your canon have have been very personal. Mm. But this is uniformly personal, personal yeah. the whole album. Um, it feels like it needed to be born, you know, without an epidural <coughs> versus... <laughs> Yeah. I mean, you, you needed yeah. to get it out of your system, you know. Yeah, and, absolutely. And I think that, you know, that's really, for me, as a, as, a, as a listener, that's really, it feels like a complete body of work. It feels, it feels like one thing. Yeah, it, well, it's, it's, uh, when I delivered it to the label, I, I didn't give them individual songs. I gave them a one long stream of 42 minutes, and you have to listen to it from beginning to end, because mm. it's an experience that you have to... You jump into the whole thing, I think, you know, whether you're into it or not, there's no point taking a little bit of it because you're not going to really get what the whole message of the record is. Mm -hmm. And and there are, you know, in the lyric books, there's no crossings out, you know, this life ain't easy, it starts there in a pencil and it ends there in a pencil and there's not one line that's crossed out, it was just there. I remember being upset when I was writing it after talking to a friend in, in America and I got off the phone and I don't know, he's like, I don't know. But it all kind of came out and you look at the page and you're like, well, what the fuck is that, you know? Mm. And, mm. and Fly Like an Eagle, the same thing, and, and Stitches, you know. Um, and Restless Mind. All those songs are kind of, um, they did have to come out. And that's why I guess when it gets to this point where you kind of, you got to kind of hand it over, you're a bit like, you feel quite vulnerable, vulnerable. As, a, as, a, as a person going, this is kind of what I was, experiencing yeah. and probably still will experience mm. um, but at the same time I, I don't really want to prevent it going out there but if it's not like a commercial success whatever that means these days anyways it, it, I don't think it's going to really bother me that much because it's well, an it's experience. already a success because it's because it's authentic it has integrity yeah it has honesty and it's courageous 